Hello everybody and welcome back to the journey to becoming a master craftsman in Mysteria Legacy. I took another journey into the underworld and I actually lived to tell the tale this time. Did some mining, killed some creatures, and went deeper than I did last time. I did find another chest, a good chest, it's not one of those evil dark chests. I got a plus one mace from it, which does require me to be level 38 to use, so I'm just going to put that on the side for now. With a little bit more exploring, I found a statue that took me home, and I took my loot home and tried to do some knitting. But I couldn't figure it out. It's not like the wiki said, unless I'm just stupid and read it wrong. Since I couldn't figure out knitting, I decided to do just a little bit of smelting before going out and doing some exploration. My first stop was to the desert, and, well, yeah, it's a desert. There's cacti, rocks, sand, pretty much it. Well, there are these tall, big flame giants who hit really hard. Don't want to mess with them yet. Then there's also these little tornado boys. They slow you. They're annoying, and I hate them. But they also deal a lot of damage, but not as much as the flame giants. Can't deal with them yet, though, so I left the desert. Because that's the only gold rocks I've been able to find. Not anymore in the rest of the desert, so might as well go. Can't really do anything. Galebrook is the next place on our adventuring list. Galebrook is the player home area where you can build but it is not safe if you don't have traps or towers or anything it is likely that your place will get broken into and probably stolen from so while I'm exploring I'm gonna tell you about our partner Dubby what is Dubby? Dubby is a clean energy drink made to give you focus with no crash Dubby contains vitamins amino acids and only 150 milligrams of caffeine there is no sugar no artificial colors or dyes, no secret formula, no hidden ingredients, and it's gluten free. All the flavors are unique and custom made by them. You'll never taste their taste anywhere else. The drinks come about to a dollar or less depending on how much you use. Much cheaper than other places. And you can use code RAPTOR10 to get 10% off your order when you make a purchase. Now back to the Mysteria. East of Galebrook, I found a place I didn't recognize at all. The Sunken Marsh. I couldn't get very far into it. There's these puffs of clouds and these giant frogs all around. And damn do they hit hard. These giant frogs basically block every entrance. And uh, stepping onto the gas was not a good idea. Welcome to the Murky Descent. I was attacked by what you see following me. Vicious Mold. That's right, you heard me. Vicious Mold. I ran and ran for my life, but eventually they were able to corner me and, well, they killed me. They hit really hard. I didn't think Mold could even hit that hard. In the end, I just went home, cooked the meat I'd gotten from a few animals that I killed on the way. If you're enjoying, make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, thank you for watching, and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye bye